proposed closure of the social welfare office in Casco Town and Bear in County Cork. Deputy is four minutes to make an initial statement and two minutes for supplementary as will the Minister. Jenny. Thank you. Thank you, Cahir. Look, um, I, I just want to thank the, uh, the Kieran Collins office for selecting this issue for debate as a topical issue, which is of critical importance to the population of, of Castle Town Bear on the, uh, on the remote Bear Peninsula. Uh, the, the town itself has a population of about 1,500 and twice or almost maybe three times that on, uh, on the peninsula that this office serves. This, all, this office serves not just the town, but the residents of Bear Island, Dorsey Island, Alahees, Iris, Garnish, Ardgroom, and Adjibal, very small and uh, remote rural parishes. I have raised this issue, Cahirlik, because I have been informed that the Department of Social Protection is proposing to cease operating this office in Castle Bear, which operates on a weekly basis, and to reduce the service down to once a month. Uh, as some deputies might be aware, Castle Bear is on the periphery of the Department of Social Protection Network, and all we are asking is that one official or from, from that department would travel 30 or so miles from Battery to Castle Bear once a week, <coughs> rather than asking those clients from Castle Bear on the Barry Peninsula to travel every week uh, to Bantry, which is from Castle Bear itself over 30 miles, but from some parts of the peninsula, you're talking about a journey of over maybe 45, 45 miles and two offshore islands as well. It's quite a challenge for, for those on social protection. Uh, public transport is sporadic, uh, uh, I suppose to say the least. Uh, Bus Air provides a two day, uh, a daily journey. It uh, arrives at half 12 and leaves again a half an hour later. It simply isn't feasible for those that are accessing social protection services from the peninsula to, act, to use the public transport service and the private bus services that operate, operate only a few times a week. Um, our clients that, that use the social protection services, as the Minister will be aware, operate or they live essentially on a week to week basis and really not on a month to month. Um, and we'd like to take, you know, we'd like if the Minister would take this into account. Um, as the Minister will be also aware, the, the Department operates 50 different schemes. So, you know, the clients that operate, that, that, that access the social protection office in Castle and Bear uh, are varied and, and the information that they receive is very, very helpful and it's unnecessary. The population around uh, in Castle and Bear is also affected by high unemployment rates. The Bantry area, which, which, which you would get the figures from, is one of the, the highest in the country. And because of the nature of the work in Castle and Bear, it's quite often seasonal and uh, access to the social protection office uh, in that regard would be, um, f f we would, you know, would be necessary, you know, after they finish work in, in, in the winter in the sea fishing area or in the summer in the tourist sector, uh, accessing social and particularly unemployment benefits uh, payments and information on those is very, very important. Getting, travelling the 30 or 40 miles to do this on a monthly basis just... One minute simple. left, Deputy. Thank you, uh, Um the other area I would like to um, to, 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 concern, to uh, address here is, you know, the the, the information, the lack of, of, of information offices within the peninsula. There is no citizens' advice bureau. We don't have a family resource centre in Castleton Bear. There is one in one of the outlying parishes, Nashville. Uh, but we, uh, you know, the, the loss of the of this office not just uh, it doesn't only lose uh, a direct service to social protection in terms of payments for unemployment assistance or benefit. You also are losing a, a vitally important information service for, for the many clients uh, that, that access the uh, Social Protection Office on the Bear Peninsula. And for the, for the information of members, the Bear Peninsula is roughly about the same size as County Louth. Do, obviously not done the in population terms. <laughs> but uh, I, I think the, the, the Minister might get a, 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 an idea of the geography that's involved. And, uh, you know, we're not asking for much. We're only asking that the office would remain open in a premises that they already have a contract on. Uh, and uh, one day a week, uh, rather than what they're proposing, is a, a once in a month service. So I'd, I'd, I'd urge the minister to uh, to look at the, at, at, the, at the appeal here. I know it's a very, very local issue, but I think it's one that reflects quite importantly for the department in how they deal with the most vulnerable clients we have, particularly in peripheral areas.